Hi everyone, this is Jessica Jung from Korea Now. On Thursday, a report about DHC Television's talk show containing hate speech against Koreans, including BTS, was uploaded on our channel and many of BTS's fans, ARMY, commented on the video sharing how they feel about this issue. It's not the first time for DHC TV to air anti-Korean programs, but this time they crossed the line and brought up BTS, which is now expanding to global boycott of DHC products. So today, let's find out how this issue exactly evolved and what led to Global Army to gather up. Last Saturday, DHC Television, the station owned by the Japanese manufacturer of cosmetics and health food supplements, aired a talk show on YouTube. During the show, one of the panelists brought up the t-shirt controversy of a BTS member issued last year. The controversy came up when a Japanese media report accused the South Korean boy band BTS of being anti-Japanese, taking issue with a t-shirt a member Jimin was seen wearing. The t-shirt had photos of Koreans celebrating independence, an atomic bomb being dropped in Japan, along with the words patriotism, our history, liberation, and Korea. One of the panelists said BTS member Jimin cheered and danced wearing the shirt. Another panel member added by calling Jimin's behavior inappropriate praising of nuclear weapons. However, Jimin was neither seen cheering for anti-Japanese activities nor claiming anything while wearing the shirt. When the issue arose, Big Hit Entertainment, the management agency of BTS, also personally visited the Atomic Bomb Victim Association to apologize and resolve any misunderstanding regarding the shirt's design purposes. In the public apology released by the agency, it said the shirt had no intention of stirring up anti-Japanese sentiment or using to retaliate against Japan, and that it only wanted to display in sequence the lead-up to the liberation of the Korean Peninsula. The Japanese panelists brought up the issue again and farther made fun of Comfort Woman statue amid growing tensions between South Korea and Japan. The public anger against DHC is constantly increasing with Global Army starting to boycott its products. DHC boycott is now on a global petition site, Change. By fabricating the story with false rumors and exaggerations, the Japanese panelists on DHC TV mocked Koreans, BTS, and even Global Army. The issue does not seem to quiet down anytime soon until DHC stops the programs provoking controversies and makes a sincere apology. If you guys have any thoughts about this issue, please leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to Korea Now for more updates. Thanks for watching.